Hello, everybody, I am Mold at Whilst, and this is Hollow Knight once again. I am trying to make my way over to the green path by going to that Stagway station. You can see where I am, and apparently I haven't found this little area yet. But I found it now, and I did find this thing. A fossilized gome wedged into the rock. So that's what those big spiky worm dildo things are called. Gomes. Now then, if I could find a way of reaching the... Uh, stag station. That could get me over to the green path. Because I saw a thing on the map of the green path over here. That little area right there leading downward that doesn't seem to go anywhere. Maybe it'll lead me into the fog canyon. That might be good. I do need to get in there in a in such a way that I'm not stuck between a wall of darkness and absolute nothingness. That would indeed help me. But first I must reach the station. Oh, there's people here now. They weren't here before. Hmm. They don't seem to mind my presence. I splash thee! Enjoy the splashing! Eh. They ain't gonna say nothing, apparently. Oh, found another secret! Wasn't expecting to find a secret, is it? It's just one of these money things, isn't it? Yep, just a little money thing. Ah, good old dirt mouth. Now I can reach the green path from this station. Much easier than getting to the one down there in the forgotten crossroads, seeing how paths have been blocked with orange stuff and whatnot. But that is a story for another day. For now, we ride the stag and go. Uh, green path, that's where. Green path away! Any day now! Are we there yet? Can you go any faster? Come on! Are we there yet? We are there yet! Yeah! Okay, now that I look at this map, I am now realizing that that does lead into the Fog Canyon. The first place that I entered it. Which is not helping me at all, as I need to find a different way in. Guy, <sighs> fucked up, didn't I? I wonder if the hunter has anything to say. Oh, your journal grows fat and full. Only those last few rare beasts remain left to stalk. Search the kingdom's corners, complete the journal, earn your well-deserved reward. Oh, sit okay, so that's all you have to say. Excellent. Perhaps that area off to the left, in the down low, the low left, maybe that will have, have something that I missed. Something vital, like the ability to swim in acid. That would be nice. Hmm, yes. There is a spot back in the fungal wastes that I was trying to get through that looked like I could get there only if I could swim through acid, which I could not swim through acid. I had no way of getting there because there was acid blocking that little way. But maybe there is a thing that will help me with that over this way. That is, if I am heading in the right direction, which I do believe I am. <sighs> Perhaps it would help. I remember this place. This is where I fought the Mega Bush. That's right. I know it's not actually called the Mega Bush, but that's what I called it. Because it looked like a bush and it was bigger than all the other bushes that tried to kill me up until that point. Alright, here's that place for, that I was mentioning. Yeah, I just gotta get across here and maybe I'll find something. I think I tried it before, but I wasn't able to for whatever reason. Probably because I didn't have, didn't have the monarch wings. 
And with the Super Darsh, this is made incredibly easy rather than having to bounce off those stupid guys in their heads. I can just Super Darsh my way across except for right here, which I have to bounce off your head to get to where I need to go. There we go. Made it. And what is this? Something I've seen before, probably. Though once our lands a pale being lays claim to the caverns ahead, it may appear benevolent, but it does not share our dream. Be wary to wander that place. Hmm. Yeah, maybe, maybe not. Who knows? Only way to find out is to keep on going and... Would you leave me alone? Hmm. How do I keep on going, though? I can't get up there. Hmm. I think I actually did make it this far into the place before. Yes, I did. There's a treasure chest that I opened. <laughs> but I couldn't go any further because of that thing there that's blocking the way. But why? For what reason does it block the way? <laughs> Noises! Hmm. Well, I'm out of ideas. Now then, let us see. Is there any other unexplored areas in this section? Oh, yes, there is. Way up top. Let's just go and do that, shall we? Not too much further till I reach that spot. Yes. Hopefully that spot actually yields some results. I've been recording for 18 minutes now and have nothing to show for it other than me just wandering around in this place. I got nothing done yet and it's almost time to be ending the episode. I still got 10 minutes left in this because I decided to record Hollow Knight for 30 minutes per episode instead of 20 to ensure that I make some progress in just, ca just in case of this happening. But it... But things ain't going so smoothly at the moment. I ain't finding nothing. Hopefully, though, that one little spot up there will be the answer to everything. Something that'll make it to where this episode doesn't just get deleted because of a lack of progress. Wee. Now, am I there? Yes, I am. No map for this area. I think I remember this place. Yeah, I do remember this place. Yes, yes I do. Yes I do indeed. Is there anything over here any further in? Something that I probably got already. Hmm. Yep. I do believe I have already gotten everything out of this little area, so I am just wasting my time here, aren't I? Oh. This... I don't remember there being another... Howling Cliffs, huh? I have definitely not found this place yet. New area! Yay! My efforts have not been for nothing. I found a new place. First objective for finding a new place is to find corner first so I can get a map of that new place. Oh, yeah. Though I feel I may have been supposed to come here a long time ago. But I didn't find the place a long time ago. I am just now finding this out about finding out about the howling cliffs. I hear his humming. Cornifer is close. He seems to be higher up. I need to find a way of getting high and fast. And no, I don't mean that dank kush. Ooh, papers. Paper trail! There he is! Give me a map, boy! 
Enjoying the bracing air, we're quite close to Hollow Nest's borders and those desolate plains that surround it. In this direction, I'm about as far as I'm willing to go, though it's been a pleasant change from the tight confines of the caverns. I've drawn out a small map of the area. It's a simple one and more com more completion, really. More for completion. Not knowing the full extent of a region can be quite frustrating. I know. Give me that map. <laughs> Howling cliffs. <laughs> hmm. Wow, there really isn't much here now, is there? Aside from that tree that's gonna give me essence once I hit it with the dream nail. Hmm. Unless there's other things here. Something good. Like the ability to swim through acid. That is something I might need. There seems to be a bench up ahead. As well as a path back to dirt mouth. Hmm. Spiky pit. Got other things flying around like that damn mosquito. And I must go downward to reach that bench. Yeah. There's a dead guy with swords stuck in the ground. Where am I? Well, I know I'm in the Howling Cliffs, but... Exactly. Ooh, so that's the bench. Hmm. A neat little bench it is. What's further in here? Ah, it's that last sword yeah. nail master. Matto, that's his name. Hmm, oh well, bet. I Yes, I thought I could sense the aura of a fierce warrior approaching. I am impressed you found my sanctuary here at the top of the world. No doubt you've endured many trials and overcome many foes in your quest to find me. No, don't speak a word. I, Nailmaster Mato, was taught by the art of the nail. Was taught the art of the nail by the great nail sage himself. Hereby accept you as my pupil. Let us begin the lesson immediately. Okay, that, that'll probably make things quite a bit easier. Yeah, train it session. <laughs> yeah. And there's the drawer. Cyclone Slash. Release the button while holding up or down. Ooh. Hell is so many. Perform. Exquisite. Now I know how my own master felt when he passed down this his teachings to us. I hope you don't think me too forward when I say that I consider you to be my child. Yes, when I saw you perform my nail art, I felt a bond between us suddenly flash into existence. You honor me beyond words, my pupil. Thank you. Bum. Okay, a bow. So the cyclone slash works just like the great slash dash slash, except you gotta hold up. Oh yeah! That'll be helpful when surrounded. <sighs> And I'm also going to have to figure out where I'm supposed to go before I start recording the next episode. And I only got like five minutes left in the recording of this one. And it's probably not going to get me anywhere other than back to Dirtmouth. Because that's where this road seems to lead. <laughs> Unless I find something else interesting right here, which I didn't. And away! Whee! Why am I falling? Hmm. Yep. Liz is the outskirts of Dartmouth, all right. Hello, Elder oh, Bug. To reach Dartmouth, most travelers take circuitous routes around the cliffs beside us. It's hard to trek now, but in the kingdom's prime, things were far simpler. There's an old pass in the cliffs that once allowed easy access. The bridge up to it has long since crumbled away, and even without it, a huge door bars entry. I can't complain, mind you. It's meant we've only e ever had to accommodate a trickle of travelers. Even during our busiest times, I wouldn't want hordes of bugs to descend on dirt mouth. I like the quiet. Well, good for you. Seeing how I have absolutely nothing better to do with the last few minutes of this episode, might as well go back in here and try to fight this boss that I've failed to beat. I've got a good feeling about defeating the Grey Prince this time.
Sort of. Wee! Now, bring it on! Yeah! Come now! I wanna face him! No, there he is! Him. The Grey Prince Zote! Come on! Yeah, first blood, boy! Aha! I forgot you send out shockwaves when you land. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Look at him wave that thing around. Ow! Step in shockwaves. Ah, he just went through the ground. There we go. Now you stay over there. That is not staying over there. There. Ow. Quit with the shacky waves. Yeah. And here come the little zote bats. I don't like little zote bats. They're so annoying and my earbud's trying to fall out of my ear again. <laughs> Ow. I walked into him. Now, please, leave me alone. And... Ha, now I got ya. And he jumped into me. Ouch! Pain! I've still got a minute left! Let's try it again! I have failed! Alright. Well, that is all the time I have for this episode. Before I start recording the next one, I'm going to look up the look up a walkthrough or something and try to get pointed in the right direction. But until the next one, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed watching. I hope to see you again in the next one. Bye!